Hello and welcome to another Minecraft video about how to survive your first night in Malin and Minecraft. You have selected to learn about the economy. In Malin and Minecraft the economy mainly relies on shops, though people do trade houses and land occasionally. To set up some land to set up a shop, you will need to find some land. Think about its location. Is it where lots of people will walk by? Also, when setting up a shop, you'll need to sell a specific group of items if you wish to maintain a customer base. For example, wool, general building materials, redstone components, armour, weapons, etc. For a very good location, you will want to be on a main route. This is the most main route in the entire Malin or Minecraft but would only be bought by someone that is quite established on the server as it costs 2,000 coins. So for today's video I shall be building on a free plot of land. When building a shop there is a particular way of doing it so that it looks better. The best way I've found is that if you build an outline with a glass front so people can see in you will get more customers as well as having a nice layout inside the shop where everything is marked. Placing down slabs as a floor means that your shelves will be less elevated and at le and not at eye line height of the players. As this allows your shelves to be only one block instead of one and a half. We can lay out the she shelves like this, which will allow you to place blocks. I am building with orange blocks, although your building can be made of whatever you want. Orange is particularly bright and like more likely to catch the eye of potential customers. With your shop built you can now start advertising and using descriptive signs. The first thing you would want to do is state the ownership, so for me that's uh, JAY, JAY, you see one, two, three, or search AJs. Um, weapon store. Or arm store. If you have membership, which costs £5 for six months and will be more thoroughly looked at in another video, you can make coloured signs as well as lots and lots of other things you can do with membership. So now that you have put a descriptive sign, got the layout right and made your shop nice and colourful, you can now start putting in the items. Here are the items I'm going to sell. To sell the item, you hold shift and right click the block. That'll then bring up the showcase creation assistant. Click in the black box and type finit. And click send. Then this is where you type the price of the item. So, a diamond sword, which has two diamonds in, that would probably sell for about 220 coins. Now you need to type how many you wish to send. Now, if you want to sell all of them, but don't, are unsure of how many you have, just type in that large number. And that will put all of them up for sale. Then, if someone wishes to buy them, item, all they have to do is hit the block and type the amount of items that they want. So I'm going to type 2. Now this won't charge you because it will charge you the money and then give it you back. If this was someone else it would charge them the money and give it you. So yes. 
And to check your balance, all you need to do is type slash money. What do you want to do?